Hey. What do you need? Hey, pal. You've done it, ma'am. You've crippled our enemies and secured a better future for mankind. What do you think, X6? Where do we go from here? I've been thinking about that. The Railroad and the Brotherhood have been beaten, but not eradicated. We're likely to encounter pockets of resistance from time to time, and we can't allow them to reorganize. I don't care. I just want my son back. I understand that. But the Institute needs a strong leader to take your son's place. This isn't the end of your work. It's only the beginning. That brings me to my next point. Better future is all I ever wanted. Then you've justified Father's faith in you, and proven that he made the right choice when he named you as his successor. Speaking of which, now that you're the leader of the Institute, there's a matter you'll need to consider. Did I? I'm not sure I made anything better. If you doubt yourself, just think of your son. The Institute was his life, and now that legacy is in your hands. It's a legacy you'll need to protect, and that brings me to my next point. What do you think we should do? We should be vigilant. If we spread ourselves thin trying to find them, we'll become vulnerable. Sooner or later, they're going to strike at us. When they do, we'll be ready. In any case, you should take time to enjoy your victory and honor your son's memory. That's what I intend to do. We'll find them, and we'll wipe them out. That could be difficult. While they're weak, our enemies will stay hidden and try to force us to spread ourselves thin searching for them. I suggest we remain vigilant while we consolidate our strength. Let them come to us. I've had enough of fighting. Let's have some peace for a change. I can appreciate the sentiment, but I'm not sure our enemies will feel the same. I'm not worried about it. I don't think they pose a threat any longer. Today, perhaps not. But they'll bide their time and gather their strength. We should remain vigilant. <laughs>